y'all, this is Adriana here, and welcome to my channel. Today, I'm coming with a crochet hairstyle, and it's for a kid, of course. And I'm with my niece here. What's your name? Destiny. How old are you? Seven. She's seven years old, you guys. So, I am going to be crocheting her hair. I bought two packs of chemo braid, and it's soft dreads. I don't know. Okay, there you go. And they look like little um, dreadlocks, but you can actually separate them, and they will look like the curls on this model right here. And I got these bags for $6.99. I purchased two packs, and I don't know if I'm going to be cutting the hair in half because they're only 14 inches, so I don't, I don't know if that's going to be too short if I cut them in half. But this is the hair I'm going to be using. I'm going to take it out the pack so y'all can see what it looks like. Let's see. So th this is what it looks like. That's the hair. Let me see. I'm going to show y'all what it looks like um, when I separate the dreads. Okay, you guys, so one dread turns into three separate curls. Here's one curl, here's two curls, and then here's the third one. So one dreadlocks give you three little spiral curls. Okay, you guys, so this is her braid pattern. It's nine cornrows. Braid it straight back. And her hair is pretty thick. So I'm just going to braid all these ends together. Somehow and then just pin it up. And start crocheting. Okay, so this is, most of this is just the first pack, and these little short strands um, are the second pack, and I just cut them in half, and I'm starting from here, from here to here with the short pieces to give it like a little um, layer effect, and plus I'm running out of hair. And today is Sunday, and our hair store is not open today, so we just winging it. And this hair is textured hair, so you only gotta like loop it twice to make two knots. Hold your head down. And it's not going nowhere. Hold it down. See, here's my loop. 
around the finger once, pull the hair through, round the finger twice, pull the hair through, and the knot is secure. Okay, you guys, so I actually didn't need to purchase another pack. I completed her whole entire head with just the two packs. And then where I cut the hair in half, where I said I was going to place the hair, um, it actually worked out in my favor. It gave the hair more volume at the top, and it made her hair look so much better. When I come back, um, her hair should be finished, so, till then. So, you guys, this is the hairstyle. It is finished. And I think I'm just going to trim just a little bit of the ends because she still is a kid and it's just a little bit. The length needs to be taken off. But this is the hair. Here, stand up. Let's see, turn around. right there yeah but this is the hair is real curly let's see but this is the hair turn around turn back around you like it is it cute yes okay so I'm gonna come back and I'm just gonna trim a little bit of her ends you can sit down I'm just gonna trim a little bit of her ends cuz she is a second grader and she's seven, so I'm just going to take a little bit off. And frame her face. Okay, so I already cut a little bit of her hair. I'm not going to cut all of it. I'm just going to cut a little bit off and frame her face. So, I think this is good for a seven-year-old. You like your hair? So, this is it. So, once again, like, comment, and subscribe to my channel. And there will be more hair tutorials to come. And again, this is the Kima braid. And it's the soft dreadlocks. And it is 14 inches. And this is what you get when you separate the dreadlock. So, until we meet again, say bye. Bye.